Hi there, Jeffrey Rhodes from Experimental Homesteader, Exotic Gardening, and SherryAnnRichardson.com. Uh, please subscribe. Uh, hit that join button, join our membership. Uh, leave us comments below. Uh, we do read them, we do appreciate them, and uh, we do try to respond to them. Uh, let us know what you think. Um... Well, uh, it was snowing off and on today, uh, a very wet snow, um, not quite a full-blown snow, it was a, a rain-snow mix, um, it may actually be a little bit of snow later tonight, early in the morning, um, there's still moisture coming down outside off and on. Um, and if the temperature hits just right, whew, we might actually get some snow. Um, no accumulation so far to speak of. Um, and uh, basically it's just been, you know, mostly just kind of a drizzling rain. Um, I uh, managed to get some wood cut up, uh, not a lot, but some, brought it in the house, um, got the wood burner uh, toasted along, um, hopefully it's enough wood to get us through, uh, at least through tomorrow, um, so that when I get home tomorrow evening, maybe I can get out there and find another source of uh, wood that I can cut. Um, right now I'm trying to do some limbs that are, that have been down and, and are, are dead, uh, that are burnable, and that uh, aren't too big around. Um, basically I'm trying to get stuff that I don't actually have to run a splitter for. Um, I know the bigger, bigger around it is and not split, uh, kind of the harder it is to burn, but I'm using some of those pieces uh, overnight so that we don't have to uh, spend a lot of time getting up in the middle of the night to, uh, you know, run to the wood burner and add wood to it. So, uh, Brought in a little kitten last night. Um, she's been outside since the spring. Uh, she's a, uh, a half-sister to our uh, current cat, Cleopatra. Um, yeah, same, same mother cat. We're not sure about the, uh, the daddy cat. So, but she was outside, and, and uh, last night, since it was getting cold, I decided to go ahead and bring her in. Um, she gets along well with Charlie. Um, he just perked up when I said his name. <laughs> um, but her and Cleopatra are kind of, not quite sure of each other yet, so we're still trying to get uh, an idea of what's what's going on between them. Um, so haven't completely decided on a name for her yet, uh, although I'm leaning toward uh, Nefertiti. Uh, since the other cat is Cleopatra, I was kind of thinking along with staying with the, the Egyptian uh, names. But I haven't quite decided yet. Uh, so, uh,
And of course, things are, you know, in the world are still spiraling uh, towards a uh, a bad thing. Um, China has decided they're going to keep buying oil from uh, Russia, but not sell to Europe. Uh, so Europe is looking at uh, having no source of uh, natural gas other than the U.S., and we uh, are having limited supply ourselves. Um, so, yeah, it's, it's getting bad. Uh, it's going to get worse. And... Uh, the simple solution to a lot of the problem is opening up the pipelines again and, and getting our own production ramped up, but um, <clears throat> that doesn't seem to be happening. And uh, probably won't happen until uh, sometime after the uh, midterm elections if the Democrats lose, it might happen. Uh, if they win, it definitely won't happen. But uh, things are just, you know, getting ugly. It's not pleasant out there. So, anyways, uh, I think that's going to do it tonight. Uh, once again, please subscribe. Uh, give us thumbs up, thumbs down, comments below. We will see everybody tomorrow. Stay safe out there.